But Mr. Speaker, I am not surprised. If you are a fan of football, and I'm happy to see you the other day jubilating when Ghana won. But there was a player in, in the United Kingdom, in, in England, called Maguire, who was playing for Manchester United. Harry Maguire. He's a defender. He was tackling everybody and throwing his bodies everywhere that he was seen as the best defender in the world. Manchester United went and bought him. He became the biggest threat at the center of Manchester United's defense, tackling Manchester players and giving assists to opponents. <laughs> Mr. Speaker, when even the opponents failed to score, Maguire will score for them. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Speaker, you remember in this country we also had an economic Maguire. <laughs> this economic Maguire went to Malata Market and were clapping, saying that this man is the best in managing foreign currency. The same economic Maguire was roaming at Central University delivering lectures on how to restore the value of the city. Mr. Speaker, when we gave this Maguire the opportunity to be at the center of our defense, he became the risk of our own goal. <laughs> Dr. Mormia, our economic Maguire, is now tackling all the fundamentals of our economy and destroying all of them. <laughs> when he said that he was the best in calculating inflation, he moved us to 40.4. <laughs> When he said that he was the best in managing depreciation that was 9% at the Dormama, he moved it to 54%. Mr. Speaker, this man was crying everywhere that businesses are collapsing because of interest rate. Today, Koku Mesa Enterprise would have to borrow about the 36% government is borrowing, somewhere around 45 to 50%. Mr. Speaker, the biggest fear now is that we may be paying appearance fee for this Maguire to now score down against the <laughs>